Hello, I'm here with Dell's sustainability initiative, Concept Luna, which we saw at last CES, but has come a long way since. It's almost 2023, and if you follow the tech industry, you know all about the big push for right to repair in the devices you buy. It's not just about fixing stuff you paid good money for, it's also about environmental concerns. And of course, the costs for tech products and their internal components are rising everywhere. That's true of laptops as much as any other kind of tech, and there's therefore a real need building up for modular laptop designs. While the Framework laptop, which we've looked at a few times in the past year or so, is the most market-ready device right now, Dell's Concept Luna could have an impact that's many times that size coming from such a big manufacturer. First of all, what is Concept Luna? Don't confuse it with Amazon Luna, first of all, which is a gaming service. If you missed its debut in late 2021, Dell's Concept Luna is centered around a fully modular laptop chassis with internal parts that can be swapped out easily and individually when they go bad. That way, if something goes wrong, you don't have to throw out the whole laptop or spend lots of time and money on tedious disassembly and reassembly. Laptops are among the trickiest tech items to fix because they are so densely packed inside. Under Concept Luna, broken or malfunctioning parts can ideally be used, upcycled, or recycled. This makes it easier to replace and fix parts, and crucially, it also makes it easier to automate the process. Tiny cables are tricky to work with when you're talking about robotic repair. Usually, you need careful fingers to unravel and press delicate cable connectors into place inside a laptop. So if machine assembly can identify, remove, and replace parts quickly, a modular design like Luna's becomes much more plausible. We went to a demonstration of Concept Luna in New York City at an event Dell held before CES 2023. The demo showed us that the new Luna laptop can be fully disassembled in about a minute or less with minimal need for screws. A small tool pops open the keyboard panel, giving a repair person or a machine easy access to everything beneath, all of which can be removed without much trouble. Cables and screws have been replaced with contact connectors and clips where possible. The quicker disassembly time applies to not only the users and Dell's repair team, but to the company's recycling partners. The fewer parts that are tied, soldered, or fixed to one another, the more easily they can be removed, recycled, and shared. Displays, keyboards, batteries, and the motherboard all age and take damage at different rates, so separating them into discrete parts as on a desktop is ideal for this concept when it comes time to replace or dispose of them. You can see that the individual parts in the Concept Luna laptop include QR codes, which makes it easier to identify and order replacement components. The pieces also have their own telemetry, tracking which machines they've been used in before, for how long they've been in service, and for parts like batteries, their estimated remaining lifespan. Dell or the user could flag which part is failing, and the automated system will run a diagnostic, and the repairs can be carried out. Now, I understand one main concern here. Should Luna hit the market, I think we all hope Dell is not intending to sell new or like new laptops with older or furbished parts that came from older laptops. These used parts would ideally be deployed in discount used systems or to replace your laptop's malfunctioning pieces with working versions of similarly aged components. As for that automation, the second half of Dell's demo showed off how well a robotic repair station can access and swap components in the new Concept Luna design. Laptop automation is not new by any means, so don't be swayed too much by how cool it is to watch this demo, but it's an effective illustration of how a human and a robot access and change the same design so easily. Dell mentioned too that for our safety, the repair station demo you're looking at here was run many times slower than it would be in a factory to boot. That brings us full circle to the holistic Concept Luna approach. Right now, this experimental design is limited to this one chassis, which is not a retail product just yet. The design benefits are clear and impressive though, and the theoretical idea is to spread the concept, if not the exact internal design, to Dell's other product lines. If the many latitude laptop fleets sold to IT departments around the world could share a similar swappable design, there are financial and environmental savings on all side, and increased accessibility and convenience for the end user. Even if it only stayed within the Luna chassis, the project could still mean a lot of raw materials saved and recycled. That's all still years off though, if Concept Luna ever does move just beyond a concept. But even from the concept presented here, it's easy to see the benefits of this simple access, modular design for more sustainable upgrades and repairs.